The Willow. Yeah. <laughs> All right. I'm good. I'm good. We got Willow. Hi, Hi, this, this is, is the Willows, Willows your, your favorite, favorite skits and relationship couple. couple. Okay, so we have a very interesting question today. Yes. When is the right time to propose? Yeah, mm. when is the right time to propose with the ring? <laughs> wow. Um, I, it's a very um, interesting question yes. because um, a lot of people are so quick to engage mm. with the ring. Yeah. You know, um, no, people don't know the right time to engage with the yeah. ring. So. We're going to talk about that today. The Willow! Yeah, Number yeah. one. So first, you need to both know that you are ready to get married. Yes. At that point, you know, need to know that yes, you're ready, ready to, to get, get married. married. So what yes. it means is that the moment you ask somebody out or you meet a lady for the first time, three weeks is not the best time to give the person a ring. Yes. And a lot of people want to do that. So a lot of people feel that the ring is the best form to cage a person or to mm -hmm. hold a person. Mm -hmm. A ring can cage a man or a woman that will cheat on you. True. A ring can cage a man mm -hmm. or a woman that has made up his or her mind to leave you. Yeah, true. So if you have the idea of the fact that a ring can keep person, mm -hmm. you miss it. True. And that's you know? why you need to understand that that ring is not a symbol of faithfulness. Yes, yes. Ring is not a symbol of commitment. Yes. Just because one is wearing the ring doesn't mean the person is committed to you. That's true. It's the heart that brings commitment. You need to see fruits of commitment. So ring is not a fruit. It's just something that is added to what the person is already bringing to the table or bringing to the relationship. So a committed cheat, when you wear the person, mm -hmm. ring, the person will be committedly be cheating is binded to cheat. So yeah, so <laughs> so ring does not seal a covenant. Ring is a symbol of a covenant, yes. not the fruit of a covenant. Yes, and not the seal of, of the a covenant. covenant. Sure, you know. very true. So, so that's why you need to put that into consideration. Why are we saying this? I'm breaking it down so that you don't rush, like my husband yeah. mentioned, in wearing someone a ring because you want to know if you want to you want to see that this person is yours. Yeah. It so have before you the give ring. the ring yes. and before you all you before you accept the ring, mm -hmm. give your relationship time. True. Time is a revealer. Yes. You know, time will tell a lot mm -hmm. about who mm -hmm. this person is. Mm -hmm. You know, so take time. You guys get to know yourself. Mm -hmm. Talk about, um, uh, um, talk about your differences. True. Talk about the things you need to know about yourselves, your family mm -hmm. background, mm -hmm. your mm -hmm. genotype, yeah. your blood group. True. You know your likes. You know the battles you face in your families. Yes. You know. Um, just talk about a lot of things, you know, do you get angry, mm -hmm. are you, you know, try to sort all that out. When you now realize that you are compatible and you are good to go, mm -hmm. it's at that point you can now decide to propose to the person. And yes, and in addition to this, talking about agreement to get married, yeah, so you need to also know that the person is ready to get married at that particular year. Mm -hmm. Yes. You know, because, you know, you can actually be going out with someone for one year, but the person is not willing to marry at the same period. Yeah. So one person can actually be saying, I want to marry this year. Yeah. Another person is not ready to marry this yeah. year. So you need to know whether both of you are actually ready to marry at a particular time. Yeah. You understand? Or the person you are giving the ring to is the person ready to marry? Yes. Do you want to give? Do you want to give the person ring for five years? True. Because because the thing is, you can actually be ready. The person may actually want to marry, but it's not ready to marry at that particular time. There's yes, a difference. Yes. You understand? So because for me and my husband, when we were in a relationship, we had to agree. We got married May 18, 2013. Yeah. So, but we had to agree that is May. Yeah. We had to be comfortable with the dates, the months, and the year. So if you if you don't come to that point of comfort with the date, the year, and the time, it means that you have not fully accepted and you're not ready for a proposal. Yes. Do you understand? It's very important. So that you don't want to start doing proposal and both parties are not. And by the time you, you, you finish, you propose to the person publicly or whatever, and the person says, oh, yes, yeah, the person is going inside to mm. say no. We have seen cases like that. Yeah. So, so it is very important yeah. not to give public proposal when you have not sorted out the relationship in private. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's very important not to give public proposal when there has not been private agreements. Yes, mm. yes, it's very important. Otherwise, you are going to feel embarrassed. True, true. You know, sort yourself internally. Make sure you guys are 
uh, on the same page yes. than before you come out publicly to True. present your ring to the person. True. So it's True. very important. True. Okay, another point to when you should give a ring to the person you want to get married to is when both parents have given their consent. True. You know, or your spiritual aid as well. So you've gotten acceptance. Mm -hmm. You know, then at that point you can present a ring. True. You know, do not give ring or do not engage a person when your parents are not aware or mm -hmm. they've not gotten the acceptance mm -hmm. you know or the person you are giving the ring to the person's parents they are not even aware do mm -hmm. not start up a journey like that it can be so risky and it can be so embarrassing True. so you wouldn't want a person to start wearing rings or you guys start wearing rings when your parents are not aware and they are so surprised seeing rings in your hand that they are wondering what is happening True. so it's important that you carry your spiritual aids along True. your 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 biological parents along before you present a ring true very true that's that's the truth yeah it's very so important. at what point again do you give out a ring you know when you have seen a high level of trust mm, do you trust true. this person mm -hmm. to carry ring for this person mm -hmm. some of you just like to wear ring and yet you don't trust the person mm -hmm. you have not accepted the person the person is beating you and you are still excited you are shouting yes 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 yes, 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 to yes. Be beating. yes because of the cameras because of social media mm. because of the peer pressure you are facing mm -hmm. you know do you trust the person can you give the person your life mm -hmm. when you are accepting a ring what it means is that you are exchanging your life mm -hmm. for this person you are putting this person you are putting your life in the hands of this person mm -hmm. can you truly give your life to this person mm -hmm. you know do you trust this person enough to lead you to be your head mm -hmm, you know mm -hmm. to handle responsibilities mm -hmm, for you mm -hmm. if you don't trust the person then there's no need wearing ring for the person mm -hmm, it mm -hmm. is very important okay so the next point is does the person want the engagement ring that's mm. another thing to look into yeah. you know because some persons don't want to wear ring yes until they're married to that's you true. so you need to ask, you see that's why during relationship courtship you need to ask very relevant questions, questions. so you don't begin to do what the other partner doesn't want to do yeah. that's the truth you need to that's what agreement is really about you yeah. have to and then you, you for you to get to the point of agreement about all of these things it's you have to have those conversations mm. ask questions would you be comfortable wearing a ring yeah and that's not because the person doesn't want to marry you the person doesn't just want the ring yeah it was it was like my wife yes. um she wore i gave her a ring a week to our wedding yeah you know it was a week to our wedding uh -huh. i gave her a ring and i really you know? wore it yes um she 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 doesn't really want that I ring really want, or yeah. those paparazzi it wasn't like or public mm -hmm. uh, display yeah. and all the stuff you know she was not into rings yes you know so it was just a week to our wedding it was even our wedding ring i just ah, oh i've not even given you a ring i'm telling you so like i just I, gave her the ring and she wore the ring. introduction now yes yeah. Yes, a week to our wedding. Yes, so that was when um, I gave her mm -hmm. the ring, mm -hmm. you know. And the moment she wore the ring, the next day she removed the ring and she put it in, um, in, the, um, case. in the case Mark. for our wedding. So the point is, does the person really want to wear a ring? Yeah. And if the person decides not to wear a ring, it doesn't make the person a bad person. Mm -hmm. There are things people are comfortable with. So we should respect their decisions sure. as well too so it doesn't mean that the person wants to cheat on you it doesn't mm -hmm. mean that the person doesn't like you yeah, you true. know there are some people that they are not just comfortable wearing rings ring is not their thing yes it. ring mm -hmm. is not their thing so true. you can have just have an understanding mm -hmm. you know that there are some people as well too they don't like public proposals that's, that's another you point. know they don't like mm -hmm. all that paparazzi true. you know ask the person don't surprise the don't person surprise. don't take don't mm -hmm. take a girl to the marketplace and you now kneel down yes then she gives you a no she yes. probably didn't give you a no because she doesn't like public proposal true. not because she doesn't like you you know, she probably mm -hmm. may like you, but you see that act you did, I don't like it. Mm -hmm. You know, I don't like public. So discuss it. Ask mm -hmm. a conf ask the person, what do you like? Mm -hmm. You know, how do you want to be proposed to? You know, it's important. Ask this question. Yeah, don't, true. don't see somebody on Facebook. Say, yes, yes, yes. Yeah. Say yes, say yes, say yes. Yeah, yeah, you know, yes. go and replicate it. And you get, you know, some girls. I, you. Some girls even slap guys now. True. You know, for doing such. Yeah. You know, so you don't want to go through that part. Mm -hmm. Ask questions. Does true. this person really want the ring yeah this is basically one public proposal like my husband yeah. said i mean study your partner study your partner that's what we're saying in essence study the person you want to get married to so i think with this few point of mm -hmm. ours we've been able to uh, throw some light you can drop your questions you mm -hmm. can drop your comments in the comment section you know when is the right time to 
to get a ring, you know, want to read your comments. I want to also respond to you as well. So yeah. thank you so much again. This is The Win Laws. You can follow us on our social media platform at The Win Laws. Yes. You can ask us questions on Twitter, Instagram, YouTube, and Facebook. Yeah. We love you so much. You do have a lovely week. See you next week. Bye. The Win <laughs> Alright. No I'm good. I'm good.